just joining us uh, this is the first episode of the latest team with lester and we have none other than ace and his player rohan bopana and of course french open winner on the show with us so rohan you you are probably the best guy to ask about this question what do you think the new normal uh, for tennis will be playing tournaments behind closed doors what is it going to happen what do you think is going to happen in the near future I mean, uh, at the at the end of the day, I mean, if you see here, there's uh, Ram Kumar Ramanathan who was talking about, uh, you know, who started that uh, four session there. He says Bob's in the house. Uh, yeah, he's the one who's yeah. been inspiring all these young tennis players and everyone. Uh, yeah, I mean, the new thing I would, uh, you know, I would say definitely, you know, as tennis players, you 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 are going to play to make your best efforts when people are watching. in the stands that when sometimes five your energy from you know the crowd being there so when i i mean for me i think it'll be very different when there's nobody really watching empty stands it's going to be difficult uh, you know but i think uh, in on the on the other hand uh, you know if you see i think we should also really wait till this entire crisis really gets better and then start the tournaments i mean there is no really hurry to really get into tournaments and just because you know we are missing the calendar to start playing i think we have enough time you know for that to happen all right well um coming closer to home i know that you have a tennis academy in bangalore two places one which is near uh, to my place uh, yalanka and of course the other one in uh, kanakpur but uh, your tennis academy the rohan gopana tennis academy has just initiated something which is the first of its kind in the country can you tell us about it please uh yeah i mean it is uh, for me it's a a very very close and a hard work art felt program because i really want to give back to the sport and i really feel by helping young tennis players you know taking my example when i was a young kid didn't have a lot of opportunities here at the sports school in kanakpura it's a, a full fledged facility with tennis and multiple sports plus education from first standard all the way up to post graduation so we are offering 60 kids from the age of under 12 under 14 and under 16 uh, aida ranking to get a 100% scholarship for tennis and education it's the first time done not only in india i don't think any part of the world has given an institution has given 60 kids an opportunity to you know uh, get a scholarship in both tennis and education so you know i think it is a very big thing for tennis and i really hope that you know a lot of the youngsters do apply and make use of this opportunity So we're going to come to choices very quickly just to see where your heart is at. Now would you prefer to win all four grand slams in a year or would you like the Olympic gold medal and of course the worldwide sportsman of the year? Uh the lo- Olympic gold medal. I think uh you know the country comes first and representing the country you can't get anything bigger for a sportsman. All right, your dream doubles uh tennis meet. uh i mean there are a few guys we you know who have had great success over the years i mean uh, uh, and uh, samula kureshi from pakistan and also mahesh bhupati from india i mean two of the guys i've enjoyed a lot of success with and it's a great friendship it's been as well okay what about dream mixed doubles player for you I mean uh, has to be Gabriela Dabrowski since i won my first grand slam with her i mean you know uh, you know can't count her out i mean uh you know both of us got our grand slams uh, you know at the french open together so definitely one of the great partners i have had um i've definitely seen your moves on the tennis court but what what do you think are your moves are on the dance floor oh depends <laughs> depends what kind of moves you're looking for i mean the dance floor nobody can nobody's really paying attention on that you know you're on your moves and it's pretty dark and you go into the night club so you know so nobody can really tell whether you're moving or not so i don't know depends i i know you, i know you're a extremely talented dancer and you have some wonderful moves and constantly are you know working your way all the way so yeah i mean nowhere compared to compared to you probably i have two left feet 
<laughs> well, we all have to start somewhere. So, would you be open to learning a hook step of a Bollywood song right now? Why not? I mean, you know, the, as they say, as the saying is, you always learn, you know, in your career. So, I'm happy to learn something new. One, two, three, four. Can you do that? Perfect. All right. So after you, after you do that, is again one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. <laughs> like your backhand one. Perfect. Then we are set. Yeah. I'm okay. getting music in now. Okay. Okay. All right. Here we go. persevere you have to persevere in whatever you're doing and if you looking to become a tennis player just remember one thing tennis is not a 100 meters race it is a marathon so yeah. it takes a lot of time and lot of discipline to make a world class champion so just think of it that way and you know mainly enjoy whatever you do but thanks all thanks so much lester <laughs> 